it's Saturday the 17th of March and it's our one year six month anniversary and we're on the classic old OFO and heading down to Waterway Point which is a big shopping center and we're gonna go and eat something or do something I don't know you have to watch and find out what we're gonna do what time is it it's quarter past four in the afternoon but I've just been editing and stuffing around at home didn't wake up till like midday so which is the Singapore thing to do everyone like goes out at night time because it's always so hot during the day and they go out at night time in the cool of the evening so we're on our way we're on the bike path let's keep going Oh, we got a green walk glide. Let's go. Ufo. Oh, Jesus, look we'll again. Oh. Yeah. Made it. Up here's where we had dinner last night. The Ching Gay Pungol Cultural Fantasy. I tell you what, that's where we're going to be tomorrow night. You might see me there if you're around. Six till nine it goes. It's got bands or something. Who knows? But we'll head on down after we go to the... Where are we going tomorrow? The IT Fair. The IT Fair. Electronics. Is that where we were yesterday? No. Okay. So tomorrow we're going to the IT Fair and then we'll go to this cultural festival thing. At Pongo! Anyone coming? Let me know down below. Here we are in the $2 shop where everything is $2. Everything. You know, you see it, it's two bucks. They don't even have to put the price on it because you just know it's two bucks. Wet wipes, that's what you, if you come to Singapore, you need wet wipes. Just carry those around and wipe the sweat off your brow and back and face and inside of your thighs. Everything, two bucks. Sweet room gloves, two bucks. Well, this look, piggy bag, two bucks. Panda bag, two bucks. Lion, rabbit, you name it, two bucks. Measuring cups, phew. Massage? It's all two bucks. Massage something. Actually, these look like something else. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, don't you? Two bucks. Oh, a back scratcher, two bucks. <gasps> Belts, <laughs> two bucks, ties, two bucks, socks, two bucks. What are these hangers for? Ties? Tie and bell hangers. Two bucks. <gasps> Hats, two bucks. A walking cane, two bucks. OMG, oh, this is glue. awesome. For your shoe? Oh, super glue for my shoe, two bucks. Here, Bernice, this is for you. Two bucks! Two bucks! This isn't two dollars. I think it's more. This is a waterway point here. A really nice mall. Hey, where's Bernice gone? Hey! She's hiding again. She hates the camera. Uh, what are we doing now? Going for... Something? Popcorn chicken? Popcorn chicken, let's go! Taiwanese popcorn chicken! Taiwanese popcorn chicken, even better! So here we go, we have got a group on special lunch today. Normally $9.40ish, we got it for like $6.40. And then we got some Sensu Ji, which is crispy, salty crispy chicken. Where's this from? Tai Ta Taiwan. Taiwanese. And this bubble tea. Pretty good, huh? Can't wait to try this sensu ji. Sensu ji, sensu ji, crispy salty chicken. Oh. Tastes better than that Popeyes, I tell ya. 
Mm. Maybe the Popeyes in America is better than the stuff they get here. Who knows? This is nice. Looks good. It's crispy, crunchy, salty. Sansu G. Mmm. Good one. And the bubble tea. Which one was this one, Bernice? Starry Night. Starry Night. It's um, lemon yakut, and I can't remember. Mm. It's got chai seeds here. Oh, here, here you go. It's lemon yakut, butterfly pea flower tea, and chia seeds. Whoa! What's Sounds butterfly? like it's good for you. What's butterfly pea flower tea? But it's got butterfly pea flower. I'm sure it's not butterflies pea, but butterfly pea flower. If you know what one is, let us know. We should just Google it, then we'll know. So, and it's got a like um, what yakult? Yakult, lemon yakult. Underneath. The digestive drink. Mmm. Maybe you need to mix it. Ooh. Yeah, that's good. Is it alright to mix? Yeah. I'll ruin it. It's beautiful. Oh, look. Mmm. That's really nice. Tastes like that uh, yakult with uh, some other cordial flavours and all. That's good stuff. You try. It's nice and sweet. Nice. And, and ice cold and really refreshing. What about you, the Sien Ji? I've had this before. Have you? Yeah. What do you think, expert? Bernice is the food expert, no. by the way. No. Yes, you are. Is that nice? Mm. Better than the Popeyes? Mm. <laughs> I think anything is. I want some more. No. I still think Popeyes is better than KFC. Hey, that's blasphemy! Sensu G me. Sensu G. Uh, uh, uh. Mm. This is our lunch with a view today. Just found some steps overlooking Waterway Point. It's really nice. It's rain. It looks like it's going to rain. We haven't had rain for a while, so we're due. We're just going for a walk to somewhere. Look how pretty this is. It's so calm. Beautiful bridge over there. It's just so pretty. Oh, wow, it's just gorgeous. On the path up there is a monitor lizard of some sort. Just chilling out. Oh, there he goes. Oh, just wait for us to come, buddy. Wait for us, because we really want to see you. Come here, come here, come for a bat. Ah, oh, oh, damn you. So here we have the Sufferer Club. One of them, there's plenty of them around Singapore. And basically this is where all the people who do national service can come for free. And they go for swims and gyms and whatever. It's just uh, something to give back to the people who serve. But there is a conscription here in Singapore where every male, once they turn, how old? But you have to do two years, which I reckon is an awesome idea. I think everyone should be forced to do one or two years conscription in the army. Why? Because there's so many idiots and gold bludgers and pathetic, weak men out there that need to get a kick up the ass and I reckon that would be a great way to do it. So have a look at this. Look at this fun little water park. Oh man we have got to come here. We can't get in though it's like blocked off. But that looks awesome. Oh I love that water slide. I want to go. It's a nice view from up here too. You don't get many vantage point views in Singapore. It's very flat country. But this gives you a bit of one. Oh, 
don't know if you can see it, but right in the middle of that park there, there's an OFO bike. <laughs> and I'm sure people must just try and find a way to dump an OFO bike as far away in the middle of nowhere as possible. I'm sure it must be some sort of a sport or a game that I'm willing to play. Maybe the competitors. Yeah, maybe the competitors. So you always see an OFO shoved like in the most ridiculous, strangest, out of the way spots that you'd never like just dump the bike and walk somewhere else. Or maybe you would. Heavenly Wang. Is my Wang heavenly, baby? Rightio, so we're here at a mall and we're gonna eat a iced sour sop. Yeah, sour sop. And that's a sour sop, in case you don't know what a sour sop is, because I don't. So, with the sour sop, you've got a piece of lime here and you squeeze it all around. So, this is shaved ice underneath and the sour sop's on top. And you mix it all through. I know this because Bernie's told me. Now I've been told it's not durian, so I better not be. My first taste of sour sauce. Mm. It's nice. It's a really nice flavour. Yeah. What is it? I guess it's like a soury flavour, but it's not really. It's like a really sweet orange that's thicker and pulpier. Oh, that's nice. Mm. Oh, yeah. What are you going to have, Bernice? <laughs> we are back on the OFO looking at God's creation and the only explanation I can find is the Logans that we bought on special. Can't wait to eat those. I've already had a few. Right, we are going now for a $5 fish. Korean fish. $5 Korean fish? Even better. I better watch out for these double-decker buses. Should we, should we go? It's a red man. Yes, yes. Why not? Come on. Quick, there's a bus gonna kill, kill us. Quick. Oh, that was close. Probably jailable offense here in Singapore. It's that time of the day. Cheers, everyone. Whoa. And here comes Bernice with tonight's dinner. The five dollar... Saba fish. Saba fish? Look at its face. With <laughs> rice and soup and chilli stuff. Five bucks. What more do you want? Right, let's try this Saba fish. Juicy on the outside, a little bit dry in the middle, a bit crunchy, crispy, soft and smooth. That's good stuff. Five bucks, mate. I mean, how good's this? How healthy. Mate, I can just feel the weight falling off. Do you dip it in chilli? Sure, why not? Eat it with rice. rice. Bucks. How good's that? So you remember the other day in the vlogs how we say that Chinese love to burn stuff and they buy paper things to burn to send up to their ancestors to use in the wherever they are. So they have things like glasses, iPhones, watches, credit cards, wallets, purses. I don't know. But well, this is the sort of stuff, and they'll burn at jewellery. So this must be the ladies' pack. 
shirts. Oh, shirts. So all these things, shirts for them to wear. All a whole variety of shirts. Oh, suits. Look, see, you can burn these suits as well. So this is jumpers in case it's cold. And lots of currencies. And heaps of currencies. I don't know. I don't know which. <laughs> What's this? That's like a trillion dollar note. So you can burn all that stuff to send up to your ancestors up in wherever they are. <laughs> that's, that's good. That's good. Good on the Chinese. God, I love the Chinese. Right, we are in a little tiny supermarket actually that we just found. What? Hey, buddy. <laughs> and uh, we thought we'd have a look around. Look at their gingers, only $4 a kilo. <laughs> But look at these aisles. Whoa, dude. Oh, where's the beer? Oh, here we go. Any on special? Is this cheap? I don't think so. Um, look at this. We see their wine, like this 15 bucks is minimum that you'll pay for like wine. Oh no, it's 14.90, whoa, cheap. Where's the cheap six packs? Okay, we have found the budget alcohol to get shit based on. This is $9.50. It's a Chinese like spirit, I'm guessing, because it's 54%. So $9.50, there you go. Panda brand gourmet Gao Lang Chiu. There you go. Go get, get yourself some and knock yourself out. So we ended up buying some Thai long ends. $4.30 I think it cost for all those. So that was good. That'll be for breakfast. Thanks for watching and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.